Hey, what's up guys? I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media back with another Dokkan battle video. And today I am super, super stoked to be showcasing the two new free to play future androids in the STR Android 18 and the Tech Android 17. Now, before we jump to the gameplay and see exactly what they can do, I'm gonna quickly go over their details. So for anybody that already knows exactly what they're all about, feel free to skip ahead to the gameplay and uh, I'm sure I'll provide a timestamp somewhere above my head here, so just go over to that time and you'll be good to go. But without further ado guys, let's jump into these translations now from the one and only Goresh on Twitter. And as always, huge shout out and thank you to Goresh for everything that he does. And we're gonna start with this STR Android 18 that you see on the screen. And just a quick side note, this might be my favorite Android 18 art in the entire game, guys. It's just, it's really nice. It's really, really nice. Okay, so, leader skill. Siblings bond category Q plus 3. HP, attack, and defense plus 50%. Super attack is energy wave, which raises attack and defense, which is an infinite stack, by, infinite stack, by the way. Can't even talk right now. Um, which means that she's going to be really good for events like the Legendary Goku event, or Infinite Dragon Ball History, and so on and so forth. And she also causes supreme damage. And her passive is I Hate Humans. Attack and defense plus 70%. Additional attack and defense plus 70%. And gains a medium chance to evade enemy attacks if there is an Android 17 future attacking the same turn. So essentially, if you pair her up with the new future Android 17 or any of the other future 17s in the game, she'll get the uh, medium chance to evade. And also additional attack and defense plus 70%. Performs an additional attack if there is a hybrid Saiyan's cat category enemy and her links are organic upgrade android assault twin terrors brutal beatdown battlefield diva dismal future and shattering the limit and she's in five categories peppy gals future saga siblings bond androids and androids slash cell saga so that is the new bay teen right there and for the 17 his leader skill is Androids category Q plus 3, HP attack and defense plus 50%, super attack is power blitz, raises attack and defense, and causes supreme damage, and her passive, for his passive, is our playtime, attack and defense plus 70%, additional attack and defense plus 70%, and gains a medium chance to perform a critical hit if there is an Android 18 future attacking the same turn, and performs an additional attack if there is a hybrid Saiyans category enemy. So very similar passive to the 18, except for him, he gets an additional um, chance to perform a critical hit, hit with an 18 on rotation, whereas 18 gets the chance to evade, and uh, everything else pretty much remains the same. And almost the same links with like one difference, and categories are Future Saga, Androids, Siblings Bond, and Android slash Cell Saga. So those are the two new free-to-play androids, guys. It's kind of hard to believe that these two are free-to-play units. The only thing that makes them makes it very clear that they're free to play are the stats but otherwise man their passives are amazing i can't wait to see exactly what they can do and without further ado let's jump into it this is boss rush 8 by the way which i decided to choose because we are facing a hybrid saiyans enemy right off the bat here in the uh what do you call it uh physical future gohan i don't know how i forgot that considering we're getting the int future gohan in like a day but anyways uh, we got the 18 on rotation perfect, and also the 17 is actually coming up on the next rotation. Uh, no, actually on the third rotation, so in two turns we'll get the two paired up and uh, we'll be good to go. So starting off here, she has 69,000, nice, 582 defense from the very beginning, no stacks yet. And I believe they, it doesn't really matter who we link her up with here, yeah, it doesn't really matter too much. So let's just leave it at that, and we'll give her one orb. She doesn't really nuke or anything like that, so it doesn't really matter if we give her anything beyond the 12 key. And we'll just give these guys some orbs as well. And let's see what this new STR-18 can do as her first attack. We are getting supered right off the bat, and we're taking 4,000. Not too bad. Okay, so 629k. And, ooh, I like that. I like that close-up. I'm not going to lie. I like that close-up quite a bit. Uh, of course, we get the additional super here because we are facing the future Gohan, who is a hybrid Saiyan's enemy. And uh, that animation is mad clean, man. That is a clean-ass animation. That really is. Okay. That is an instant rainbow for me, man. I mean, yesterday, before I even saw the details, I told people, I was like, yo, this 18 is instantly getting rainbowed. I can't wait to farm her. Um... I mean, you guys know, man. You guys know how much I love these androids, but especially Android 18, man. That's why it hit me so hard when I couldn't pull 
Uh, I messed up this rotation, it doesn't really matter. Um, we're not trying to showcase these guys. I just actually wanted to put the LR androids out of rotation so that eventually um, they can support the free-to-play androids. But uh, as I was saying, man, that's why it hit me so hard when I couldn't pull the new LR androids on global in like 3,000 stones, man. Not because like it was a bad, sh okay, yes, because it was a bad shaft, but also because, man, I just love the androids so much, man. And after what they did to me with LR Gohan, 3,000 stones on his banner with nothing, I thought for sure I was going to get the LR androids, and it just didn't happen, and it hurts, man. <laughs> it really, really does. Okay, this is awesome. We're getting an awesome, awesome rotation here. Um, unfortunately, this guy only has a tiny bit of health left, so we're not going to be able to see their full potential, but let's actually attack with the 17 here. And we also have the support from the um, other free-to-play, the Krillin and the 18 right there, so we should see something pretty nice here. Okay, what are we getting? 9 point, or not, not I was, I almost at 9.6 mil, almost a million, 968k, and hold on, no, this guy must get a boost on this event, there must be some kind of, how do you do 4 million damage, was that right, wait, am I, am I crazy, did I, did I, wait, these androids must get some kind of boost on this event, because, that is way too much damage. Um, <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me, let me look this up. Let me look this up. Okay, I'm not crazy. The weakness on this specific Dokkan event is future Android 17 and future Android 18. So that's why uh, 17 did 4.1 million damage right there. Um, this might not be the best representation, actually, of their damage now, now that, now that I think about it, because... Um, yeah, dude, they get a pretty big boost on this event. But you know what? It doesn't really matter. Pay attention more to their attack stat as opposed to the damage they deal out because it's going to vary from event to event, right? And uh, sometimes the enemy is going to have a lot of damage reduction. So even if they have a high attack stat, they're not going to be doing a ton of damage. So uh, yeah, don't mind the numbers too much. But that was still pretty cool. I, I got to say, that was still pretty awesome. <laughs> this man did 4.1 million damage. Oh my god, for a super too. And he does stack attack, of course, so it only goes up from there right okay okay uh we back here with the androids and also the lr android for support really awesome uh, i'm actually gonna put the android 18 here um and she has 88,000 defense now so that's pretty good that's pretty good okay let's give her one orb over here and we'll give him one orb doesn't really matter they get basically they basically auto super uh when linked with each other and let's see what happens here by the way, they do share like six out of their seven links, I believe. Okay, so one million attack here now from the new free to play 18. Okay. <laughs> All right, we're doing one more event for sure. We're definitely doing one more event. That's okay. Um, wow, wow. You know what? I Oh, on the one hand, in my mind, I'm like, maybe I should just start this over with another event. But on the other hand, I'm like, I kind of want to leave that in there, man. That is freaking awesome. Okay. Uh, <laughs> dude, I'm, I'm having a lot of fun right now. Um, I, dude, I love these androids, though. I, I really, really like these new units. Um, regardless of the fact that they had the boost on this event, uh, she was already up to a million attack, right? She was already up to a million attack. Um, on her second super, even though with a really good support, but nonetheless, man, that was that was going to be a double super. The 17 would have gotten a double super off as well, and it would have been over either way, I think. Even without the boost, I, I think Gohan was done for in that rotation, you know what I mean? So, yeah, it's hard to believe these guys are free-to-play units, man, seriously. Like, <laughs> they're just so freaking good. They just made them so, so freaking good, and... You know what, as, as always with these free-to-play showcase videos, man, I gotta give props to Bandai for uh, being, you know, okay with just making free-to-play units really, really strong these days, man. A lot of these free-to-play units are better than most of the old, like, TURs, man, the ones that didn't get easy A's yet. And uh, if, you, oh, if you guys haven't watched it yet, real little quick promo for myself, I did make a video of seven um, old units that desperately need easy A's. And uh, I talk a lot, a lot about those units that like are so bad that they're definitely worse than like almost all the new free-to-play units we've been getting recently. So uh, go check that, check out that video if you haven't yet. But um, yeah, going back to what I was saying, I mean, 
man, <laughs> these guys are really good. <laughs> they're really, really good. And if you pair them up together, obviously, if, you, if they're not, like, with each other, um, they're not nearly as good as they could be. But when you pair them up together, man, they're better than, like, almost all of the other uh, Android 18s and 17s in the game. Like, almost, almost. I mean, there are some exceptions, I'd say, like... The Tournament of Power 18 is still amazing, um, and and you know you know for support like the STR um, Krillin in 18. I mean I know it's just 18, but I want to differentiate the two. So the one with Krillin in the art uh, is is phenomenal as well, right for support. But man, these two are like two of the best free to play units we have ever received. Like no question, no question whatsoever. So we're gonna attack uh, this AGL type here with the 17, and oh, we're also facing Hybrid Saiyan, so we do get the additional super, and obviously we're gonna attack him with uh, 18, and I guess it doesn't really matter. I am a little bit worried about the support 18 at the end, but it'll be fine, I'm sure. I'm sure it'll be fine. It's all good, it's all good. Okay, so over a million again from 18, or 17, sorry. Um, really clean super once again, just like the, the 18 has. 1.4 million and an additional super right there, obviously because we are facing uh, actually multiple hybrid Saiyans enemies. Are we going to get a second crit? Okay, back to back crits. Okay. Okay, I see. Okay, triple, triple super. Triple super <laughs> from Android 17. These androids are absolutely insane. Oh my god. Can we get us? Okay, so I, I forgot actually that... Uh, the 18 does get, no, the 17 does get a uh, medium chance to crit with the 18 on rotation. Um, but still, that was impressive. That, that was impressive. The triple back-to-back-to-back -to -back -to -back super, uh, supers as well as crits. Um, we took that stage down a lot faster than I expected, to be honest. Man, this is crazy. These androids are crazy. They are insane, dude. Um, yeah, I mean... If you guys have any doubts about whether or not they were worth farming, this video should be enough. This video should be more than enough to tell you that you gotta do it, guys. You gotta do it. It is a hundred, one million, million percent worth it. Do it right now. Actually, you can't do it right now because it's not available yet, but when as soon as they drop, man, do it. Farm them, get them done. Uh, you will not regret it, man. They're so freaking good. It's crazy, and in this event, we can't even really showcase how good they can get uh, after a few stacks of their attack and defense, right? Because they do both stack, attack, and defense infinitely. Um, so maybe like a showcase uh, on the, you know, uh, what's it called? A Legendary Goku event or Infinite Dragon Ball History is in order sometime soon because I definitely want to see what they are like at their full potential. So right now, uh, 17 is already at 102,000 defense because he did super three times and uh, she's already at 75,000 defense after the one attack and let's uh, let's get that a little bit higher let's get that a little bit higher I mean I think he's actually dead this turn so we're not gonna be able to see too much else but uh, oh maybe we can get a token attack oh we can get a token attack off okay so we're token attacking with the 18 here let's see what she takes to super for I'm guessing it's still gonna be a bit of damage because she only supered one time um, let's see, oh, yeah, 130k, okay, don't mind that, don't mind that, it's all good. <laughs> it's not a big deal, she she would have taken a lot less if we actually allowed her to stack a few more stacks of defense. I, I don't really know what the other word I was thinking of is, but you guys get the point, you guys get the point. Alright, Doken attack with our girl, Android18. Uh, she does not get the additional super here, unfortunately, because she only... Um, I mean, she's not facing like a hybrid Saiyans, although she might get, no, okay, I was gonna say, she might get it from her additional, or from her hidden potential, or her passive rather, no, um, her passive, no, what am I trying to say? <laughs> from her hidden potential, from her hidden potential, okay, she get the, get the, she did get the dodges though, she did get the dodges, and, uh, yeah, 17 is tanking very, very well, and I think these LR androids are gonna finish off Goku here, which will pretty much finish off our showcase, um, I'm getting very excited, guys. I'm sorry about my my words being all jumbled right now, man. But I, I was expecting some good things from these androids. I was not expecting this good. You know what I mean? I, I was not expecting this. It's insane of um, performance from these two guys. So, uh, yeah, definitely, definitely blew away my expectations. 
and uh, I'm curious to see or hear what you guys have to say as well in the comments down below. Let me know your opinions about these two cards. I mean, for the art alone, I would have rainbowed this 18, but now seeing how good she is, especially paired up with the 17, both of them are getting rainbowed ASAP. Um, I will be doing a stream for that on my JP account when they eventually come out in like a day or two or something like that. So uh, yeah, guys, that's going to do it for today's showcase, man. They are freaking, freaking amazing. Two of the best free-to-play cards in the entire game. No question. No question. And uh, I just love it, man. I love all this Androids love. Um, and now I just hope that I can get those LR Androids at some point in my Dokkan career. We'll see. Fingers crossed. All right, guys. <laughs> Enough of that. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video. As always, if you liked the video, then make sure to like the damn video. And uh, if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, and you like what you see, then definitely hit that big red subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad now. And while you're at it, hit that notification bell too, so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it. I'm out of here. Hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Apricot Media. Signing out.